is everybody today? <sighs> I'm good. I'm tired today. I even got my mushroom coffee. And it's not waking me up yet. I wanted to um, open the other package. I think it's the rest of the stuff that I wanted to um, decorate the office with. So I thought I would open it and see what's in here. Sorry for all the noise. Let's see what we got. I have ordered just like a bunch of small orders. I either get, you know, to spin the wheel and um, you get so many items, like if you spend like 20 bucks or something like that. So, just a lot of little items. Except for the one that I ordered for the office. I'm just going slow because I don't want to cut anything. I'm like, Look at all that tape right there. Um, let me get my tablet over here so I can tell you guys the prices. But I gotta start ordering for Christmas and birthdays um, pretty soon. So happy with my um, rolling cart. Do I think it was worth $13? Absolutely not. It's very flexible. It's, it's not like sturdy like it looked in the picture. Um, I wouldn't order it again. Okay. So this first thing, I've had it in my cart several times. And I always take it out because it's being shipped by a, a local warehouse. And I didn't want to pay two shot two dollars and ninety nine cents for shipping for one item. So I finally found it. And I didn't have to pay for shipping. But it's one of those oil to sprayer for your oil. Um, it's called a one piece portable oil spray and dispenser. I paid $3.97 for it. Hmm, don't know what that is. If it's some type of a seal, it's all messed up. We will see. Feels like. Hmm. Let me see. isn't open but if it goes like that then it's not open hmm Oh, that's cool. Sorry, I'm just trying to get it, but it doesn't want to stay. So anyway, that goes around here, but you can see it's all messed up. Um, it goes like this. And then you can either spray it with this here, or there's this little button right here, and it opens. I like it. I like it. Anyway, I'll play around with that and see. 
Um, I paid $3.97 and it comes in different colors. It's $3.97 still. I got it in um, white. It comes in green, yellow, and black, which I really like the green. Um, and I actually have two of them in my cart, so I might order me a green one as well. One for the trailer, one for the house, or whatever. This is, I kind of think I do know what this is though. I just want to get everything open so I can, um, yeah. Okay, and I am not good at these. My daughter-in-law had to do this last time. It's a decorative 3D acrylic crystal plum. It's a vase with um, stickers that go up the wall and they're kind of thick. It looks like that when it's all said and done. And I wanted to put it um, in one of the corners of the office. But I don't know, it's so pretty. And on the picture, it has butterflies as well. So we'll have to see. Let's see how thick it is. So I'm anxious to try it. And See how it's going to be. I have um, a wall sticker 3D in my bedroom at home, and um, and then you just peel these off and stick them. And actually, um, we didn't even use all of the ones that I had. Then the one for the vase, and then here's the little butterflies. We'll have to see. Um, that right now is two eighty eight, and I paid uh, three eighty two. Love these. Love, love, love them. And these are um, calla lilies. I got a 10 piece for $5.43. And they are $5.59 right now. Oh, they actually smell good. They don't smell bad. They smell like a... It's a floral scent. Um, but they're... They're not plat. I mean, they don't feel like, like hard plastic. Hold on a second. Okay. One of my... Now I don't know what I did with it. One of my uh, process servers came in. I had to give him some work. Well, um, oh, here they are. Look at these. Those are beautiful. Beautiful. So I really do like these. And for five, what did I pay for them? Five forty-three. They're worth it. They're worth it. And they don't stink. I don't know what they smell like. That's bugging me. It's a floral scent, but it smells really good. I paid $5.43 and they are $5.59. So now I just gotta find me a really pretty vase to put them in. Okay. Do you want else we got? got 
more of these headbands I hauled last time. I hauled, um, I think I got the brown and white ones. And this one I got the multicolor. So I figured these would be good for when we go out to the lake, because we've been going out to the lake quite a bit. Um, and they're just easy to put your hair up. And um, I like the way my hair looks whenever, whenever it's up. Um, for those... I got a nine piece uh, multicolor. They're 350, I paid 350 and they are 314 right now. So that's not bad. Okay. I'm excited about this shirt. Um, I love watching murder mystery shows. I love watching um, CSI, detective movies, um, unsolved mysteries. <laughs> I like murder shows, comfy clothes, and maybe three people. Now the last part's not true. I got lots of friends on here and I like you, I like everybody. Um, the iron-on, you can fill it, but it's not bad at all. That headband cute. And I got size large. And it's 95 polyester and 5% elastic. So, anyway, you'll be seeing me wearing that in the next couple of days. I paid $6.98 for it. And it is still $6.98. And it comes in all kinds of different colors. I mean, a lot of different colors. Okay, and here is the, do you remember the plant? Um, I thought I was getting this wood piece with plants that go on it and hang underneath it. And it's a decal. I had ordered two, here's the second one. So I'll probably put one up above my, um, on my desk, on my hutch thing that's right here. And then I might put one above my windows. Um, so we'll get them put up and then I'll let you know. Um, I'll let you guys see how it is. For that, I paid... This was free. And it is $2.37 right now. And I'll show you a picture. I know I showed a picture last time, but just in case nobody's seen that, this is what it's going to look like. Once it's done, I think it'll look good over the window. I like how it hangs down like that too. So we're gonna see. We're gonna see. Hmm. I think I might know what this is. I don't have very many items left in here, so. I've never seen one being hauled before. Um, and actually, I'm on Timu every day because I'm playing the games again. I had told myself that once I won, because it took me about six months. That I'm not going to play them anymore. But I had gotten so many. Um, from doing orders. I had gotten so much water. 
that when I won my game, it rolled over. And so I had tons of water left. I'm like, well, I'll just use this water up and then I'm not gonna play no more. Well, now I'm down to like three cents on one and I think I have one fish left and I'm at like 82% on this. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. 82% on um, one fish and then I just need to feed the other fish. So it got me hooked again. So I'm still playing, but this is a, it's a unique wooden rotating. I got it for free. Um, it's a calendar. Isn't that adorable? I love it. Oh, sorry. Let me get it up. on hopefully now it goes like this there we go so you squeeze it at the bottom to get it in and it is Wednesday August what is it the 21st it is Wednesday, right? Look at that. Isn't that the cutest? <gasps> I love it. Um, again, I got it for free and it is 534 right now. But I will show you. It comes in different um sorry. comes in different styles. Let me show you. So I got this and I think it was called the Ferris wheel, the half moon, and the shovel. The Ferris wheel, the half moon, and the shovel. I got this one. I like this one as well, so I might get this one um also which might be in my card already the moon is 650 the ferris wheel is 698 and the shovel is 534 but i just love them So I got two things left in here. So this I got. I don't know if I want to put it in the office or put it in my office at the house. I don't know yet. But it is. A rustic chalkboard wall sticker. Um, it's 39.37 inches. I paid $547 for it and it is still $547. But I thought um, the kids would enjoy it being able to mark on it. Sorry if you guys can't see. But I really liked it. Um, or I can give it to, um, one of the kids. We'll see which one likes it. I don't want to roll it out. I'm just going to leave it like this. It does come with some chalk in there, I believe. Let me see. No, but it's, well, it sounds like there's something else in here. Just didn't want to open it yet. But let's see. So 
I can put it in this little thing right here. They got it all shoved down in here. Just one pink chalk. It's broken, but I got tons of chalk. So, I think the kids are going to get a kick out of that. Okay. And the last thing. Um, again, it is 547 right now. And the last thing I got is for the office. And it's called a magic broom. See if we can get it put together. It feels pretty sturdy. Um, I guess while I'm doing this, I can give you guys an update on the property. Um, we, because when we had gotten approved for it, um, sorry, we have to get pre-approved again. Um, when you're pre-approved, it's only approved for 120 days. Well, we've lived at the place we've lived at for since 2011 so 13 years and um, we had put up like it was a carport and then my husband turned it into a shop it just screws in he turned it into a shop so he bought um, enclosures for it, um, side enclosures, um, like aluminum siding, and put side enclosures on and um, covered the back. And then in the front, he put up a roll-up door. Um, and it has like siding around it. So it's all enclosed. And we didn't get a permit for it. And so when we were putting our, we were going to put our house on the market, the realtor's like, well, if you guys, because we were going to take it with us originally, and I mean, we may, it could be still a possibility, but the realtor's like, we could possibly get the offer on the house and then somebody that will pay for it to stay because he done a really good job. It looks good. Um, the people behind us on one house over put one up just like it. He liked it instead of spending so much money on having a garage built. So, anyway. 
So we've been trying to get this thing permitted since 2023. Um, and we found out that the drawings, so when we bought the carport, it did have drawings. Well, we bought it in 2016. The drawings now are not up to code. The code changed in 2022. So we kept trying to upload them. They told us to contact and get new drawings and we did. And those drawings, um, the newest drawings that they had were from Utah and their code didn't change. And so the new drawings were from 2020. So they told us that, well, you guys need to get new drawings on the house. Well, that was gonna be over $2,000. And so we're like, just forget it. Um, we'll just take it down and take it with us. Well, the next day, the next couple of days, we get in the mail a citation because the house wasn't permitted. And so we had to go to a hearing. So we went to this hearing and then we explained everything. And luckily the guy that was in charge of the hearing was also um, um, an engineer. And he goes, no, I'm just gonna pass it because Getting new drawings is gonna cost a lot of money. Um, it's been up, it's just been up this long and it hasn't blown down. It should be, you should be good to go. So we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna sign off on it. Go ahead and get your approval and then um, just get it inspected. So we are waiting on the inspection. Um, we're just kind of playing phone tag right now, which I need to call as soon as I get done with this video. And, um, so once that gets done, then we'll go ahead and put the house on the market. So seems like it's taken forever. It's not exactly what I was thinking. Um, we thought we'd just buy some land and buy a mold manufactured home and put on it. <laughs> it's not that easy. And it may have been easier um, if we had just had the house already and put it up and then we could have already been out there, but I was being stubborn. It's like, nope, I'm gonna prove my point. And we're gonna be able to stay in this house until the house is ready because I didn't wanna live in my RV for four months through the summer, which I'm so thankful that we didn't because we had like extreme heat here um, like I said, I didn't know that heat waves come in categories. We were in a category five. It was very hot. So, I mean, I have to, when I move out, we have to move into the trailer. Um, and I'm okay with staying in it for a little bit, but I just didn't really want to stay in it for four months, but, um, I'll be fine. And I would rather do it now you know, like in September, October, November, and then hopefully be in the house by December. So, um, anyway, that's what, that's the update. And I know I haven't spoken about it. I was talking about it a lot and then I just kind of gave up on it. But anyway, I can't get the bottom in, but here's the magic broom. And I'll give it a try. I just got it for the office, something small, and I can just hopefully hang up. Yeah. So I'm going to try and get this um, fixed, but that's it for this order. I just wanted to get it opened, make sure I got all my packages because, you know, that one time I was missing stuff, make sure nothing was broken. So I'll have time to um, turn it in. But yeah, that's it for this order. I got a couple more at the house and um, we're going to see what else we got. Um, I also, right now, I'm sorry, right now this is $7.19 and I got it for free. I got the clock for free, the desk calendar, I'm sorry, for free, this for free, and then the plant um, sticker decal, I got those for free. Um, and I get, you know, like I said, it is $7.19 right now. Um... But I am trying, and I don't know if any of the other um, channels have tried. Um, it is an app called VidIQ. 
and it gives you daily tasks. So, um, like, what are my daily tasks for today? Let me see if I can find them. Mm. Well, anyway, it gives you different ideas for videos. I think it gives you up to three a day and um, the different ideas um, one idea was hauling 103 items so if I did that I would definitely have to do um, multiple orders and then do one big haul but that would be so long especially with me chatting could you guys imagine uh, it's a challenge it would be a challenge to try and haul 103 items and keep it around 40 minutes Maybe I'll do that. I might do that. One was um, to do a collaboration. And the other one was... Oh. About a ghost story. Which I am going to have another ghost story for you guys this week. So that might be the one I'll do this week. Um, it, it just kind of gives you ideas to talk about on your channel. It... You link it to your channel and it kind of sees what your content is, gives you ideas to help you grow your channel um, and get more interaction. So anyway, I've only been doing that for about, I think I downloaded it on Saturday, I think is what I did. So um, I'm going to be going through that and seeing that. But if you guys, if anybody's using it, let me know because I'm very interested on what you guys think about it um, or any other things that you guys do use to help with your channel so all right guys that's it for today i'm gonna go ahead and put all this away and try out a few things i will show you guys at the end of this video my little rolling cart i wouldn't order again but i'm going to pull it out and i'll show you guys um and i'll hook it up at the end of this video all right hold on okay so i have this little drawer here for this desk and it doesn't have any shelves or anything so I thought I would get this put stuff in here I just have makeup and pins in there right now um, and it comes with these little hooks but it's I don't know um, it looked different in the picture it's not very Dirty. I mean, five bucks, maybe, yeah. 13, no. And I think yesterday when I hauled it, it was down to 11. Um, but I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I just put it in there and roll it back there. And I should have measured. I could have probably seen if I found something a little bit bigger. But it'll work for now until I find a replacement. Um, so we shall see um, where I plan to put the sticker. One of the stickers is up here on my hutch. And then over this window. Right there. So... It's coming along, it's coming along. It's just, uh, I gotta clean that hutch right there. This is my desk, which is a complete mess right now with everything on it. So, any hoot. And then for Christmas, I got my YY mouse pad, which I love. I just gotta make room for it in here, but. Uh, my friend Peggy painted this cabinet right here. And I love it. So I think I'm going to do the office in like the grays that the furniture is. Black, blues. 
And then, well, now I'm going to be throwing in some of this burgundy or whatever color those flowers are. Um, that's the shoe rack I wanted to make into um, like a holder for my, for these. But my son come up with that, left that. Oh, so yeah, it's come along, it's come along. All right, just wanted to show you this, and then um, I will show you once it's decorated and I get the pictures up, which hopefully will be in another within another week. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Um, I just wanted to kind of give you an idea of what the office looked like at the end of this haul, um, the office supply haul I guess is what I could call it but all right guys um thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe down below and I did add a watermark at the bottom I think it's at the bottom right I'm not sure um that has subscribe on there so hopefully that will help with getting more subscribers and um anyway let me guys know let me know if you guys see it um and then I also got a couple more tricks. I'm going to see if they work. If they do, I will definitely share them um, and let you guys know um, if it's working. All right, guys. I will talk to you guys later. I'll have another haul for you guys soon. I hope you guys have a great day.